Alright guys, today I'll be showing you how to um, how to uh, put a logo in a video for a YouTube web or a website or like a home video. Like I see, you might have a video right here in the corner, on my bottom right corner, I might have a logo. So, you know, first of all, you need a Sony Vegas Pro. Um, and Pro, the 8.8.0 version. And a video, of course. So here's my video. And I'm just going to drag it there. And... Next, I will be show. I will be. I right, see here the, the loop region. You can this thing here, the loop region. You're gonna drag this all the way to the end. Video. There we go. There's the end of the video. And you're gonna need a, a, an image. I'm just gonna use a YouTube logo on the way. I'll just delete those two tracks. Delete track. Delete track. And next, you're gonna need to just click insert video track. And you're just gonna stick your YouTube logo or uh, logo in the video. And here, here, I, here's mine. I'll just extend the video. And you see here, it's right in the center of the video. Right here in the middle of the video. But we don't want it in the middle of the video. We kind of want it at the corner, you know. Right here's track motion. Okay, go into your video track and click track motion. Here. And right here, make the video smaller. I just see here. Look, the image got smaller. Make it a bit more smaller and drag it in the bottom of the video. And I just dragged the bottom of the video. And look here, the logos come with it. So I'm gonna click X, and I think the video is kind of good enough there. So that's how you stick a logo in your video. And next, you're gonna need to click File, Render As. Because you want to save it maybe as a AVI or WMV to, so you can put it on YouTube or something like that because they're the better kind of formats. So here in document I'll say to my desktop and I'll say video YouTube YouTube and save it as a WMV and put the default te template as 3 megabytes per second and click custom quality preview I know this this just actually better because it doesn't take up as much memory or it won't be with the file size won't be as big like could be a hundred or uh, megs and you can have it for like 20 megs so preview oh so custom preview and go down to audio you can change whatever you want there video video <coughs> change the smoothness to 80 the video smoothness to 80 and um, bitrate change the internet LAN to one and click OK and click save. Oh no, I made a mistake, sorry. You're gonna need to the loop region, I thought I did that. You see this loop region here? Oh uh, the loop region and Let's zoom out a bit. I right, stick this loop region all the way to the end. I made a mistake there, sorry guys. Mother. Right there, and click render as. Yes, 3 megabytes per second. Custom. Preview. Video. 80. 80, so. Uh, that's 80 other bit rate. Oh, I'm slowing up my computer. Bit rate, stick it to 1M. Okay, and then stick it, I'll just stick it to YouTube, YouTube vid. So click save. And it's rendering. And look here, there's my video just starting to render and it's showing the logo. This video is going to take about how long to render? 2 minutes 40 to render. So, so this, thanks for watching my video. And if you like my videos, just subscribe or rate or comment. And uh, if you need any help, I'll get back to you because I, I know I kind of went a bit faster in this video. I just, I've had. <coughs> I made about five of these videos and they all went wrong, I don't know what happened.
and I just got tired of making one, so this is the last one I'm probably making. So, as you see, this one went perfectly right. So, YouTube logo there, I see right here. And, and that's really it, and I'll get back to you. So, thanks for watching.